Right, hello folks, welcome back to another episode of the Football Manager Save. A few games off camera last time out, you would have seen Manchester City and Levante. It was the 2-0 victory over Levante. Fantastic. We played this um, team here, I can't, UB conse Consequence? No idea. 4-1 uh, victory. Uh, Jose Carlos, one of our young uh, strikers, scored a hat-trick. It was, a, it was a decent performance from the uh, the youngsters. Followed that with a 2 0 victory over Levante, Kovalenko, and Braun later getting on the score sheet, which was great. And then we played the the young folks again, but we we lost in the Copa del Rey second round. A penalty in the 80th minute put us to the sword, despite the fact that we played a fairly decent team, like. What? Very, very, very disappointing to go out in the second round of the Copa del Rey. Very embarrassing for us as they are a second division side. Really? Really? Seems to be the way of that anyway. We can win in La Liga, but we can't do anything in anywhere else. Anyway, we're just going to have a look at uh, some of the transfers that have come in and out. We've brought in a few players. First one is... Gustavo Zabala, he is going to be a star man on that side, hopefully playing um, better than Braun later. Him and Braun later will probably compete for the spot. Looks like with his current ability, he will be first in uh, at the moment because his star rating is phenomenal. And 20 passing, 18 acceleration, 18 balance, 17 he just looks phenomenal. 15 first touch. He's got great. Yeah, he looks good. And we only played 15 and a half mil for him. And that is it. Thank you, River Plate. Very much appreciate. Yeah. We then went in and got a, another deep lying playmaker. Another defensive midfielder. I don't know why I keep buying these players. But I am in the business of trying to sell Barry Nuevo, who can also play there. So it's not the end of the world. But he's a decent enough player, and we bought him in for 35 million up front um, with 50 mil in potential add ons. And he hasn't really done too much. He has played in Europe a couple of seasons with um, Strasbourg in the French division. That was many, many years ago, almost a decade ago since he's played. He's gone back to Brazil. He's, he's played with Santos most of the time, and he's, he seems like he's pretty injury free, I must say, playing 40. Or so games every season um but he looks decent enough like this his positioning teamwork vision and work rate look fantastic his tackling is good his passing is good composure concentration he looks good brought on a couple of youngsters mads cray being one of them he looks like he's got decent potential six foot five danish striker only 16 years old he's already got the six 16 first touch 16 technique looks pretty decent only got him for 4.8k, so good good for us. And he's yeah, six foot five at 16 years old. Could be a beast. Brought in Thomas uh Krizyak as well. Um 105k. Really it. He, he's 19 years old, check left back. He's not he's not the greatest player. Um but he'll he'll do a job when called upon, and yeah, we'll see if he can get decent enough and then the last player that we brought in is Fleming Knudsen another Danish striker this guy only six foot still 16 first touch 17 determination he's got a lot of 13 to 15 ratings as well he's got fantastic potential ability we brought him in for two mil with potentially 12 million dollars in add-ons and he, he's come from Randers FC as well so we've just pinched two of the young strikers which oh, might be a shame for them but Hey, if they if they can do stuff for us at Villarreal, it will be fantastic. Looking forward to seeing how they go. Um, and we've only got one player that has left us, and that is just Damien uh, Corridora. He's gone on loan to Intercity. And that's it. Trying to get... Um, my goodness, look how many players Intercity have of ours. Fantastic. Trying to get rid of Barry Nuevo, um, but that's not really going to happen, I don't think. Uh, we'll 
do this. We're going to be playing um, Real Madrid. So you definitely need a good good performance. And I want to make sure Barry Nuevo don't want him in defense. I want, uh, I want Mario. Who's better, Godinho Diaz or Dionzi T? Okay, it's definitely Godinho. That's fine. Ritter can come on to the bench. And where's Kovalenko? He's going to start. I need that. Where's my new winger? Zabala. He's going to have his debut as well. He's going to play as a winger on support. And that, to me, is the team. Looks like a decent enough score. We might just chuck another winger on the bench. We chuck... It'll have to be Braun later. Because I've had to unregister Christian Pulisic, so he will no longer feature for us. And he's going to be retiring anyway. But still... Pierre in goal, De La Vibora, Tarski, Mario, Diallo, Godinho Diaz, Erdi Alonso, Zabala, Treore, and Kovalenko up top. <sighs> Let's hope we can do something. Um, we better give a squad number. Oh, it's going to have to be 25. We're playing Real Madrid. We have beaten two of the big teams so far, so... I'm pretty, I don't know, reasonably, reasonably confident. I don't know. It's, it's a tough, it's a tough one. Real Madrid not in the greatest form. Uh, only two wins from the last five, and they drew and lost to their last game. They are playing at home, and we are a few points clear of Barcelona, at least 10 points clear of Real Madrid. I would like to keep the... Uh, the run going eight points if we draw here, but then again, Barcelona do have that game in hand. So, yeah, a win here would do us the world of good. Keep the pressure on Barcelona, and we'd look pretty good for said league title. With 50 points already just in January would be fantastic, but we uh, we're one nil down, seven and a half minutes in. Olivia Diara, who is a fantastic striker on the game. Uh, very, one of the better regions that has uh, happened. Or been created, I should say. I don't really know what. He's just, he's just got it in. It's, it's a fantastic goal. Um, not too disheartened, though. We are fairly used to going behind early on in the games. And as long as we can... As long as we can do something, I'll be pretty, I'll be pretty happy. We don't want as long as we don't embarrass ourselves, really. Good ball, uh, not great ball from uh, from Pathy Diallo there, but still worth a try, I guess. Not sure who half of these players are. I do know their goalkeeper is um, the goalkeeper we had at Fiorentina that we sold to Celtic, funnily enough. He's come back and he's gone to um, Real Madrid, so good on him. How much? Okay, losing here only puts us on 49 points. Real uh, Barcelona win their game. They go three points. For, they'll go three points yeah, we lose here. We've got we're three points behind in front of Barcelona, but we've got a cross here. Trey Warriors header is just over. Close position is pretty even. We haven't really created a lot of chances, uh, which I would prefer if we could. But I'm assuming their defence is bloody fantastic. Because we've gone two 0 down. It's Roberto Moron who has scored. Villarreal all over the place, they reckon. We may have to go for a quick tactical change. Look at this. Just smacks it in first time. No one marking the fella. 
don't think we'll bother working the ball in, but we'll focus our play a bit wider, run at their defense, we'll try and distribute to the target man, and we'll force the opposition inside. See if that does anything for us. I'd love to get a victory over Atletico Madrid, Barcelona, and Real Madrid. How good that would be. Kovalenko just misses the rebound. Absolute shocker. We just need a Real Madrid player to mess up. Um, but I know some of the, playing some of these teams, it's almost impossible to, to get victory over them as they're so good. But here we go. Kovalenko is taken down in the box. It's definitely a penalty. Whether or not we can score the penalty is another thing entirely. I believe it'll be Alonso or Godinho Diaz actually. No, Alonso will take it. Okay. Praying that he scores. Oh, he's saved. You bastard. Why did you have to shoot that way, Alonso? It's going to be a goal kick. Made a meal out of it. Julio, why? We needed that penalty. Need to shout some encouragement at the team. Can't believe that. 2 0 down at half time. Show a bit of desire. Not happy with your defense. Not happy with the playmaker. I'm not happy with your finishing. Should we play. Least direct, shorter passing. Let's try that. I don't know. Kovalenko's not having a great game. Neither is Tusky, De La Vibora, or Pierre. No one's really having a great game. It seems to be some of the players on that. Diallo, Alonso, and Traore. They're playing on that right-hand side. I wonder if maybe we should just focus play down there. Could always... Make some changes as that's offside. Wait, what? Did one of my players push him? And now it's a fucking pe Oh, for goodness sake. You better save this now, Peer. He won't, though. Mm, told you. Nah. Get off my pitch. Um, bring on Reyes to play in that more attacking role. We'll change this winger up to uh, attack. Confirm those changes, please. Pierre or Paris, whatever his name is, he's he's having a mere. Absolutely disappointing from the team. Like, Kovalenko, oh, so bloody close, but so far away. <sighs> we need to win this game, or at least not lose, to keep the pressure on Barcelona, otherwise we're going to lose. I can't imagine we're just going to win every other game. It's going to come down to the buyer. We had such a good position as well when we were... We were in such a good position, but no, it's 4-0. Oh, thank God he saved. Get on attacking team. Let's just... Let's just get out there and try something. Defend this corner. We don't need to go down anymore. Come on, Zabala. It's your debut. You haven't done horribly, but you haven't really done... You haven't had a chance to really show anything. Uh, Eugenio is going to come in for Tasky, who's having a shitter. Um, I'm going to have to take off Kovalenko for Aliasma. Let's fire up the team. <sighs> come on, boys. At least, at least give them, at least ruin their clean sheet. Come on. Here we go. No. Get it away. We're out to see. It's Diara versus three. Good. We managed to 
sniff out the shot, made it hard for him to try and score, but still, very piss poor performance. There is no excuse for this bad of a performance. 12 shots and only two on target for us. Real Madrid have had half that amount with four on target. Absolutely disappointing. That, simply put, was not good enough. Furious with your defense. Not happy with your playmate. Furious with your finishing. Just had a guts full. It's not a Champions League game. Why didn't we show up? Yes, you can leave. Yes, you can leave. Okay, don't. 45 mil. If you want them, Leal, you need to do that. Southampton received 12 mil from us. Great. Steel of a Boris, 250 league appearances. Good on him. Well, we're going to be playing Sociedad next in uh, about a week's time, so we'll see you then. Barry Nuevo has left the club. He's gone to Marseille for 45 mil, and yeah, he only made 54 appearances over seven years, but why not he had a couple of loan spells? He was a world. He's played 10 games for us this season. He played 21 last season. It's all right centre back, but I think we can definitely do a bit better. So, yeah, now that we've got some money back in the kitty as well, Fantastic, although the the overall budget's not great. Um, I will go and have a look for some more players. I feel like we might need another midfielder. But just a... Just a central midfielder. Let's see, Traore's out with the flu, so I'm, I don't know who I'm going to have to start. It's going to have to be like one of the youngsters if we're going to play a winger, unless I offset the... But I don't know, oh, we've just got Rodrigo Sierra and he's yeah, he's he's not really fit to play. So what we will do, we'll have an advanced playmaker and that will be um wherever he is. Bubble. There we go. We'll play Zabala as a winger on attack. And we'll try and focus. Oh, can you play? No, you cannot. Can you play there? No. <laughs> no one can play. Can Braun later? I don't believe he can. No, he cannot. We'll, we'll just have a significant disadvantage. Let's go. Has Diallo been in better form than he has? Yeah, let's just go and let's try and focus our play down the left. We'll see if we can do something here. Hopefully they don't just target Diallo because he's got a lot of work to do. Um, Jeez. <laughs> um, well, yeah, they've, they're in bad form. They're in 12th. We're in first. We're on a two-game losing streak, so let's break that now, please. I could have played with two strikers, I guess, as well, but... That's fine. Barcelona now uh, only two points behind us. Continue to be three if we can win this game, but they just won their game in hand. 6-0 against Gijon. 6-0. Whereas I don't think we've scored more than four in a game this season. We haven't been doing very well. I say we haven't been doing very well. We're on... 50 points from 20 games. We're doing well. We've won all but three games this season. We've drawn one, lost two, I think. So we're not doing too bad. Um, obviously, there's no highlights whatsoever to start the game. Here we go. 32 minutes in the first one, and it's great tackle from Bubble, who wins the ball. He's going to go storming down to pass Zabala. He's going to get crunched in the tackle, but he's going to win the ball back. He's going to have it across. Kovalenko's header has hit the crossbar, and they take it away. Free kick for them here over the post. Very close. Lucky. 
looks like we'll probably go into the half nil-nil. We've actually had 60% of possession, which is new for us. And 13 shots, three on target. We should have a goal and a bit more according to the XG, but I'm not happy. We, we have the ability to do stuff and we're not... Uh, not doing anything just yet, so keep it up, folks. I have changed the positions in midfield, so Erdi's a deep line playmaker. Richard's gone to a ball winning midfielder, and Alonso is a Mazala. Okay, get the tackle in and let's go on the counter, please, guys. We need a goal, and we need one soon. Otherwise, they're just going to shut shop. Oh, that was very close. We almost conceded, but a goal kick. Oh, great. Zabala's picked up a knock. It's only a bruised ankle. Okay, we'll leave him out there for now because he's playing well. Okay, maybe we should take him off. He's got the, the sad face. He's apprehensive. We'll bring him off. Braun later can come in. Um, what if we do that? Bubble's not quite there. Yeah, if we chuck you on support, we can bring on Eliasma as well. So we can not. We don't need to do that, but I will get them to get up a little bit more. Can we score? No, we're only two points behind Barcelona. We we need to keep the we need to keep it going, guys. Come on, get the victory. Let's encourage the team. Erdi with a long ball over the top. Nothing. Someone put in a tackle. It's gone down to the man Quintala. Quintanil Vanilla. Oh no. Romario Barrow has scored 70th, 79th minute. We need to score two in 10 minutes. I'm not watching this. Oh, for goodness sake. That's a three-game losing streak now if we can't get the victory. Three games without a win. Braunlade has gone down. It looked pretty soft, but we'll take the penalty. We just need to make sure we can actually score it this time. Come on. Surely, surely we can score this penalty. I mean, I'll have to take the draw. Good on you. Okay, come on, Alonso. Missed a penalty against Real Madrid. Don't miss another one. Get in. 1-1. One, one. Let's go. Very attacking for the next eight minutes and try and take this victory we need we've been so much better let's fire up the team come on we've easily been the better folks here 23 shots eight on target 2.63 xg and we can only score a penalty Disappointment. Disappointment. What? It was not good enough. What are you doing? Oh, for goodness sake. I mean, the only... Oh, we've come so close. <laughs> so close, but no. Oh, jeez. All right, well... We're still in first, but only by a point. Barcelona will overtake us. We're still, still, we've got 38 million. See who I can buy. I feel like we need an alternative to Alonso and Erdi. We've got Reyes, but we could do with another player as well. Form seems to be going down the gurgle. Well, luckily, we have a decent bit of um, we have a decent run, at least. 
Um, gonna bring you back for the Barcelona game in March. I'll play these six games off camera and we'll bring you back for Barcelona. We'll see you back very shortly. Thanks a ton for watching, folks. We'll catch you in the next one. Make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Peace.